Okay, so to people who already got abortions, yep, can they go to heaven? Absolutely. Okay. What Absolutely. do you want to say to them? Can, can, I don't, and I want to speak to a, a few different parties here. Um, one is the okay. woman who who had the who had the abortion, mm -hmm. but then number two is um, partners or husbands who have encouraged their girlfriend or their wife to have an abortion. Okay. Um, three or family members, parents mm -hmm. who either, who encouraged it. And maybe even fourth one, I know people who have actually financially paid for abortions. Okay. And then later on deeply regretted that. What about the doctors who do the abortions? Yeah. I mean, same thing. Um, okay. And so I, I think that there's, just, I mean, there's a, uh, yeah, there's just a reality of that. So for all those individuals, I guess I would say that absolutely forgiveness can be had. Absolutely. You can, you know, come to Christ, be cleansed, be made whole and, and have, eter have abundant life with him and eternal life with him. Um, and, and I mean, and again, I know several women who've had abortions. Mm. Um, I mean, multiple women who've had abortions. And 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 thank God that by his grace, by his forgiveness, and usually and usually with the help of others around them that in 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 church, family, and community, and especially those that have that have had abortions too and can come up alongside them mm. and say, hey, I got forgiveness. I received healing emotionally and spiritually from this you can too mm. um and so i i guess that that's what i would say because my heart breaks for them um because i know that there's individuals that especially man you've had abortions you've paid for abortions and now you come to know christ and it's just like oh what did i what have i done you know um i mean literally just talking to an individual uh, a gentleman about this this like this week um this last week about it where and he paid for a, an abortion and just broken by that, you know, that, that all these years later going, Oh my God, what, what did I do? You know? Um, and so she'd have gotten the money for somewhere else. Yeah. Don't but, worry about it. That's terrible. <laughs> um, and so, you know, and, and so, you know, for those that have had abortions or for those that provided financially for it or for, or who encouraged it and now are, I'll say now you're kind of realizing, man, I did that. That's uh, man, why did I do that? Like to know there's forgiveness and to know there's grace, to know there's mercy. Um, for those that have kept it a secret, I would say find someone and tell them. Whether it's a a friend, a counselor, a pastor, just kind of like unburden yourself from it. Mm -hmm. um, and because I just I've seen that happen, and where where someone has kept a secret for decades and they finally kind of get it off of their shoulders and off their chest for the first time. Or maybe it was all, maybe that it was just the husband and wife who knew and that was it. Mm. Um, and, but for them to be able to tell it, say it out loud, you know, um, I think is hugely important. Um, and so, yeah, I mean, and I mean, and I have very, I, I, I have, I mean, close friends who have had abortions, paid for abortions, encouraged abortions, and to see their lives transformed by the grace and the love and the forgiveness of Jesus has been pretty incredible to watch. So, um, and if you're listening to this and you've had abortions and you you don't feel regret or those kind of things, like I'm not here to like try to guilt you into regret, you know. Mm. But I do. I would say that. That that even to to you, uh, maybe you're hearing it and you're considering it, and you're thinking about it, and maybe you've never like really thought uh, through the man. Was that really a human life, and what was involved? And um, you know that uh, as you consider that, know there is grace, know there is mercy, know there is forgiveness in Christ for those actions, and I think. One of the coolest things that I've heard several of, of my friends say is that that child that 
you know, I did the unspeakable to, I will get to see one day. Yeah, they're having a better time up there right now than you are. Yeah. And so the fact that they will get to see what a what a joy, what a hope that is, mm. you know. Um, and so it, it's pretty, pretty incredible. I know one lady in particular and um, had a couple of abortions and unfortunately was not able to have children after that. Um, and, you know, and so one day, even though she's been childless here, even one day she will get to see her children. Mm. And I just think what an incredible, incredible gift that will be to her. And and obviously they won't be, you know, uh, kids or, you know, that kind of thing we were talking about. But yeah, how's that work? Uh, you know, that's a, that'll be a whole different discussion. And, okay. uh, but <laughs> I just think, the, but, but how cool is that? You know, that she'll get to see them one day. Oh, great. Right. No, it's not going to be like that. <laughs> so, yeah, I just, but I just think how, how amazing that's going to be for her. Um, so. Okay. Yeah. yeah. No more abortions. No more. That's it for abortions. Yeah. That's all the questions I got. Thank God. Thank God.